When a window graphic is viewed from both sides, every speck of dirt, every imperfection on the glass is noticeable. So before you start that application, it's really important to create a clean zone. Keeping your work area clean can be a challenge when you apply large window graphics. Typically, you are removing large areas of liner at once, which creates a tremendous amount of static. This static can draw particles from as far away as four feet, so creating a clean enough environment can be very tricky. Here are some tips to creating a clean zone. First, using a damp cloth, wipe down not only the window sills around the windows you are covering, but the adjacent windows as well. Not only removing dirt, but lowering the static level of these surfaces also. You can never clean a commercial floor with a vacuum or mop well enough. Throw a drop cloth on the floor and mist it lightly. Sometimes it is hard to see which side of the glass the dirt is on. So, using a mild detergent mix, clean the glass on both sides. IPA is an excellent final surface prep, but it can create static. I prefer to use an 80-20% mix of water and food grade white vinegar. Look for uneven caulking lines and trim them back to be as straight as you can. Irregularities in the caulking can cause the edges of your graphic to lift. Even after the general clean zone has been created, it's a good idea to wipe the sills down again before installing each window to keep the static to a minimum. Creating a clean zone does take some time and effort, but a window application free of any imperfections will be sure to set your team apart.